What's going on YouTube, the Luke Gamer over here. I thought I'd just show you guys the new ROG Claymore keyboard. My personal favorite keyboard. I'm loving the texture, the feel of this keyboard, the way it's so nice and soft, and also the travel distance, because these are the cherry blue keys over here. But I thought I'd just show you guys why it's worth it actually buy this product and the reason why I love it so much. As you guys can see, it just ties in with the theme of the ROG Spa the Mouse with the really cool ROG logo down there too. But what I'll just do is I'll show you guys, you know, why it's worth it. But let me just show you guys. These are the blue cherry keys over here. So as you can tell, you can always take it out. And the travel distance is not really that far. It should be about two millimeters deep. It's not too, too deep. But that's the reason why I love it because I don't want something too, too deep that goes too in the keyboard. But something that has a nice travel distance as well. Sorry, fellas. Actually, not two millimeters, but four millimeters deep. And also, the thing I'm loving about this keyboard too is the fact that you get this really nice ROG symbol at the bottom and you get the really nice branding over there, the ROG Republic of Gamers logo. And let me just show you guys the back side of this keyboard as well. Yeah, the back, guys. So what we get greeted with is a beautiful branding over there, Claymore Republic of Gamers. We also get a really nice ribbon cable over there but that attaches to the keyboard really, really easily. And we also get a really cool stand in case you guys want to levitate it up or down depending on, you know, your surface or your table. And we also get a really nice grip to avoid slippery surfaces in case you're wondering if this, this keyboard will actually fall from it. But other than that, guys, we just get the same on the other side. And in case you guys are wondering, yes, this is, this is a bit of magnet, uh, a thumb magnet or a fingerprint magnet rather. But you know what I'm saying, it doesn't really take away the quality of this really nice uh, keyboard. But let me just flip it over. Just thought I'd just do like, you know what I'm saying, like just another shot for you guys to actually see, you know, how beautiful this keyboard is and the cherry blue that really pops out of it. But yeah, fellas, this is what I'm actually rocking right now. But it's definitely worth the price of, you know, of that 240 Definitely, definitely for me. I'm loving it. I'm loving the detail of this keyboard. But let me just show you guys the software and how that keyboard works. And also how to sync this together with the ROG components. If it's a, if it's a mouse or anything else. Alright fellas. So yeah, we are again with the ROG Armory application. Which is, we get presented this beautiful keyboard over here. So unfortunately guys, we don't get the number pad that you see displayed on the right. That's actually sold separately in case you guys are wondering that. But what we do get obviously is just the keyboard. So just thought I'll show you guys a customized option over here. So what we get here is a gaming mode. Which you press Alt and Tab. Or Alt and F4, but that, that isn't really something that we didn't know already. But let's go to the lighting option over here. So what happens is we get ourselves five different profiles. So we're able to change each profile for each different game or each different theme that we have within our PC. So you're also able to change up the colors, all the effects you guys want, up to Ripple, Reactive, all these really amazing effects, or even custom the effect that you really want to. So you're able to even go in depth now. So you're even able to go to the game present. So you could say well, while the game is present, you're able to change all these features over here or even add an effect, which is pretty sick. So it goes pretty much in detail with the customizable effects. So I'm really loving that. But I'm going to leave mine back on static because I was just preferring that kind of option. We also get this really nice macro um, sort of recording mechanism. So in case you guys want to see which macros you're using in certain applications, you're always able to record them and then add them to your profile as well which is pretty sick. So all you, all you just gotta just do is hit record and then press your buttons over there, do your thing, and then when you actually stop doing your thing, you can actually stop it and then add it to your profile in case you wanna add that to your uh, other profiles within your applications. Really, really fresh, fellas, I'm loving it. Also, you're able to sync any ROG platforms from one to another. So in case your mouse is, is blue and has a static effect, you're also able to uh, sync that to your keyboard effect. So in case you want breathing, these will both breed together, so which is pretty, pretty cool. Also with the same color as well, which is pretty fresh. Also, the stats over here, you get keystrokes per second. So you're able to actually record that and see how fast you're able to click those numbers and those letters, which is pretty fresh. In case you want to see if your keyboard is reacting to a certain desired you know, functionality, I'm loving that feature as well, fellas. But that's what we really get with this really beautiful Armory application over here. And again, fellas, we get ourselves five different profiles. So you're always able to customize that depending on the kind of game or the kind of application that you're using on that day. But yeah, guys, that's just the ROG Claymore keyboard review. Thank you again for watching this. Just thought I'd just show you guys my little, you know, man cave while I got, you know, lurking in that man cave. But thanks again for your time, guys.